Good morning. It's, I don't know what day it is. <laughs> I think it's our fourth day, Monday. I lost track. Uh, 46 miles in. We have about 12 and a half miles to our final destination today. I'm not sure if there's going to be anything exciting today. Just like there was nothing exciting the last couple of days. So two monster hills today. Yeah, two monster hills. So, I'm going to get on down here. Get moving. Our next waypoint is in 0.9 miles. Hopefully it's a parking lot. I'm really, really hoping there's a garbage can there. Because we really, really, really need to unload some garbage here. It's starting to build up. So... That's all I got right now. We'll see you on up the trail. Well, we're at the waypoint. This is the highway. <laughs> and there's the parking lot back in there. Can. So it looks like we're trying to a little bit more. Uh, we got 2.2 miles up the Rocky Gap here, and it is going to be a fun. Straight up. Straight up. As you no can. reason. Yeah, no reason to be having to go up there. There's a perfectly good valley right over there around the corner. All right, we'll see you guys up at the top here. Halfway up, uh, it's steep. I don't know if you guys can see that mountain in the background there. That's the one we climbed yesterday. We're going up this one today. Tracy says we're bagging mountains like a grocery boy. All right, let's we'll see you on up the mountain. Well, I got to the first waypoint here, a rocky gap, big highway here. <laughs> uh, I think we got about another 0.5 miles to, uh, I think it's called Kelly Knob. So we're going to be climbing a little bit more, about another half mile. And then we should be going down for a better part of the day. So. And I think we have a mile, a mile and a half more climb before we start going down. I don't know if it's, I don't know. It looks like a half mile on the map, but who knows. We'll just keep climbing until <laughs> we start going downhill. So it's tough. We got 3.1 miles down. Two hours. Two hours. Uh, Not these bad. Are, these are some tough climbs. So, all right, we'll see you on up the trail. I've been in your world. Holy moly, the second half of that hill was insane. Half mile straight up. I think we gained like six, 700 feet of elevation gain in a half mile. But we passed the 50 mile mark for us. And it seems to level out right now. And in about a mile, we're coming up. I'm hoping it's a viewpoint that make it worthwhile this climb, Kelly Knob. So, we'll see what it is when we get up there.
just got to uh Laurel. What is this? Laurel Creek uh, shelter. Uh, we're gonna camel up here, just grabbing some quick food and all that. Um, we got a big climb ahead of us today, so trying to get some energy up for that. I gotta take a look and see what the mileage is to the where we're staying at tonight. Um, I think we're over halfway there, though. I'm really hoping we're over halfway there because it is 1.30 in the afternoon. I don't want to be rolling into camp at 8 o'clock at night. So, Trace, how you feeling? Feeling good now that the pack's off my back and we're sitting. It was hard. It's been really hard training. That was a hard, that was a hard mountain today, up mm -hmm. and over it. And without a view, that's what sucked. All right, guys. Well, we get some food in us. I'm gonna get some food in me, and then filter some more water so Trace can eat too. So we'll see you up on the trail. Cameled up with a ton of water. I got one, two, three, four, six, six and a half liters on me because this next shelter is up on top of the mountain and we don't know if there's water up there or not. So don't want to get stuck without water. Uh, we have six and a half miles to this shelter. It's 10 after two. So we're really pushing to get in there at a decent time. We have a massive climb coming up here um, starts about two and a half miles before the shelter so I was saying about four miles we got some ups and downs here we're definitely an up right now a steep up but an up nonetheless so we'll see you guys on down the trail Yeah, it's kind of nice seeing that. It's a change of view from being in the green tunnel the whole afternoon. So, nice to see wide open spaces. We're out in the field now. Holy moly, it's warm out here, <laughs> but it is pretty. Oh, thank you, sweet baby Jesus. Whoever this trail angel is with the trail magic, oh, thank you. This is awesome. Oh. That mountain right there is the one we climbed this morning, about 4,100 feet. Now we're here. Now we're heading up another mountain. We just took a break back there. It's a parking lot. 
We have 3.1 miles to go to the to the shelter. A really nice water source here. Um, the next mile and a half are going to be hell. I think we should just stay here. There's a stealth site. Just saying. Just saying. <laughs> no, well, we're going to try to get on up this mountain. We'll see you up on the trail. And it's tight, 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 fat man squeeze. Ouch. Ouch. Okay, so I just gave myself a self sacrifice through this turnaround here, or turnabout, or whatever the hell you want to call it. Arms all shredded up. And I walk a mere 10 feet. And Oh, let's open up the gate for them so they don't get scratched. Son of a bitch. about a quarter mile to go and it's up all these rock steps we've just gone up about 800 feet in about three quarters of a mile holy I'm exhausted so let's get up these steps here You're gonna stop somewhere on the way for dinner up there. Why don't you call ahead and have them bring a pizza to us halfway up these steps. Holy shit. All right, I gotta get on, climb back up this. Yeah. <clears throat> that was scary. First thing when I went, all I thought was how far down am I gonna roll before I hit a tree? Or can I find a stump or a branch to grab a hold of? Luckily I was able to grab a hold of one of these sandstones on the edge here. And then once I know I got stable, I look down and I just see the GoPro going to doom to doom to doom to doom to doom. So it's a good ride for the GoPro. But then I had to climb back down there and get it. Yeah, we're gonna sit here for about 15 minutes. We're about a mile and a half from the shelter. I just gotta get my wits with me. 
get together here and get focused. So I'll see you on up the trail. We got about half mile of camp. Came in that opening before. Saw the thunderstorm coming in. We're gonna hear the thunder now. So we're trying to hike it up this one last hill. Bruiser's Knob, I think it's what it's called. And then just past that is the camp. A couple hundred yards, I wanna say. So, I'm gonna try to hightail it, get to the shelter before the rain hits. All right, this is a big rock, Karen. So we got to where the shelter was supposed to be at and it said, there's a sign, Sarver Hollow Shelter, that way, 0.4 miles. Way longer than 0.4. Yeah, oh yeah, it's like a mile down here. And uh, as soon as we started on that path, it started pouring down rain. So of course we're soaking wet. But the worst part about it is this mountain that we just climbed and spent most of the afternoon climbing and sweating. I fall and almost kill myself. We just went down the whole other side of it to get to the shelter. Now tomorrow, to get back to the AT, we have to go right back up it again. And tomorrow's a 16 mile day. We we're only supposed to have one climb. Now we got two. Jesus. So that's the AT for you. So pretty nice place here. Um, we sleep in there and you can eat here. And it's all covered, so we're going to stay in the shelter tonight with the rain and keep dry. So, we'll see you guys in a little bit. Alright guys, it's 20 to 9. We actually have the tent set up in the shelter. Uh, we came back from the privy and I found this huge spider on my sleeping bag. And we looked up in the ceiling and it, the place is infested with some. The biggest spiders I've ever seen. And I know that sounds like, oh sure, right, right. That stuff usually doesn't bother me. These things were huge, so we set the tent up. Ain't nobody else coming in tonight. We set the tent up so that we're all encased and there's no way they can get in at us. So uh, we're gonna hit the hay here, try to get up early. Uh, we got a long climb up out of this place here tomorrow morning. So we'll talk to you guys tomorrow.